Welcome back to my channel. So this is some guidance and this is honestly relevant anytime, but specifically this week or whenever you're seeing this, do it this week is an exercise to help you to awaken miracles in your business in life, to help you to manifest clients and opportunities and ways to get your work out into the world in a big way. Many of us have incarnated right now, and you might feel this too, even if you're not exactly sure, depending on what stage of the journey you're on, what, what exactly your purpose is. Some of you know exactly what your purpose is, but we are alive right now because we came for our own evolution and growth and spiritual expansion, but we also came to help other people. We came to help this collective wake up. And many of us are light workers, we're healers, we're star seeds, we're earth angels here to help the planet. And so we need to be getting our work out in great ways. And why would God not support that? Why would God not want to support you in getting your work out into the world? And so what would it take this week for you to, one, to welcome in God, source, divine, your higher power, whatever you believe in, the label, it really isn't that important in my world. But I've brought back the word God over the last couple of years because it just felt really nice for me to so see what, what works for you with that. And even universe, God source, I'm inviting love into my business, into my bank account, into my client into my opportunities, all these things. I'm inviting God in to help build my business and take things to the next level with my purpose. And you could even walk around while you're making your coffee in the morning and just pray and say, God, source divine, thank you so much for leading me on my highest path in my business. Thank you for bringing me the right opportunities and people and ideas and creative strategy. Thank you so much for bringing me people on my journey that can help carry me forward. God, source, thank you so much. Letting God in this week. And then I want you to start noticing what ideas start coming to you, what creative ideas, because when we ask, when we pray, the answers are always given. So notice, even if it feels like something very small, something very insignificant, or something very little to do as a next step, or something grandiose, trust that what you're receiving is for you to start taking action on. And that's what we want to do, is start to take action on the things that we are shown and bring those things to life. So if you're getting action steps this week to do a YouTube video, or to put your face on video, or to reach out to somebody or to do something specific, hire someone new in your business or whatever, start a podcast or take the program or work with me, <laughs> shameless plug, um, then take, take a moment to tune in, to trust your intuition, to trust the visions you're getting, to trust where you get magnetically pulled to go and what you get magnetically pulled to do and just start doing it. Because action too is going to, this is like a part two to this, action is also going to release the pressure and the anxiety that you have, right? Like sometimes we feel pressure and anxiety because we're not actually moving things forward in the way that we were being guided to. And one little step that could be seemingly small could shift everything for you. Okay, so we're going to pray. One, we're going to pray, invite God's source in this week. Two, we're going to then listen, pay attention to what's coming in. And three, we're going to take action on all the little things. It could even be like clean your closet out. I have my my female entrepreneurs mastermind purging things in their closet. The last like last week and this week, getting rid of old stuff, really like even purging old thoughts and beliefs in our minds that are holding us back from being where we want to be in our next level of success. So then taking action on those things. So let me know if this resonates with you in the comments. I hope this supported you. Make sure that you subscribe to, to my channel so you get notified. I'm going to be doing many more videos on here. And feel free to also share this with anyone who might need this. We also have a podcast episode that launched this week if you need some more support. It's all about creating abundance through, through being your true self not hiding your woo-woo, <laughs> and also being fully expressed as you. One of my past clients, Grace Emmons, is featured on my podcast this week, and I'm excited to show her off with you, but also share some inspiration to help you on your journey.